problem that we're attacking is trying to look at um, a new structural system that is being developed to um, have a rapid return to occupancy following earthquake. Uh, the, the new structural system that we're um, researching in, the, in this project um, essentially consists of your conventional elements, beams and columns, um, except we put it together in a fairly novel way. As such, the system essentially consists of uh, columns, dual columns that are spaced closely together um, and can in effect be thought of as one column. Um, but by interconnecting those dual columns with these replaceable links, we essentially achieve ductile behavior in the structure. And then the rest of the system essentially remains the same. The system will absorb um, the energy in, in one location and then we're going to replace the links with new ones and then the system will start working again. All the damage is concentrated in this portion here. So there's two main components to why we're here. Uh, one is the fact that we can do things at large scale. So it's a fairly large facility, we can build a full two-story two frame. Um, and the second component is, even though we can do it at this scale, we still don't have an entire building. But using the hybrid uh, testing methodologies that, um, that the lab is capable of, we can combine sort of an analytical model with an experimental model in order for us to look at a system behavior at a truly system scale, not just, not just a sub-assembly scale. With these results from the experimental part, we can calibrate our numerical model and ultimately validate the link column frame system. The slightly unique thing about this project, I think, is um, that it is a bit of a bridge between where we think the, the, the state of practice is going to be in, say, 50 years from now and where we are today. The advantage of this project is because we're combining existing elements of an existing structural design practice, it's a little bit more attractive to get adopted more rapidly because despite it being novel, it is still implementable.